a little bit. Back up a little. Okay, right there. I'm going to hit you a lot of low volleys right now. And I want you to just hit neutral volleys back here or short angle. Okay, move a little to your right and back up a step. Okay, that's realistically a good spot where you might get to. Okay, ready? All right, see, you don't want to go that way. See, believe it or not, they couldn't hurt you on that. You got to turn. Yeah, you're going to have to, yeah, you're going to, if you see a ball coming towards your right hip, low, you got to get out of the way a little. Yeah, you got to get out of the way. Backhand should be easier. But that particular shot, the last one you hit, you kept the ball so low to the net, this person couldn't hurt you on that. But it's not a good habit to get into because Many times when you're down low, you have to hit up and you hit the ball. See, then they can put it away. You see? That particular one was so low. He's down here still trying. So he might hit up, you know? But the point is, low ones, if you're going in this direction, there's a good chance you're going to pop it up too high because you've got to hit up to clear the net. Low ones. Cindy's going short angle or deep. Oh, that was tough. That, that was super tough. That was a half volley, really. That, you should have taken that on a half volley. That's excellent. Okay, she just missed it, but I like, I like the technique. Beautiful. These are the kind of shots you need to work on so you don't miss them. Here we go. Now I'm going to the backhand. Beautiful. Woo. That's a fantastic angle. Okay, move a little to your right and back up a little, right there. Because I want you to get comfortable hitting low balls from that far from the net, which is not easy. Beautiful. Good, step in with your uh, right leg on that backhand. Yeah, your low ones again, forehand. Fantastic. All right, beauty. That's what you've got to do on a low one. Keep it to this side of the court. Don't hit that way, towards that net person. Excellent, way to get out of the way. Beautiful, Cindy. Okay, now, you get the high one. Here we go, now you know where you're going. And see there, you're kinda, let your arm really just go spaghetti. I want you to go for this shot. Come on, air it out. That's it, come on, again, hit it. That's it, go for the home run. Okay, that's okay. Then you just smile, you went for the home run, so what, you miss hit, you know? Okay, Cindy, so I'm not gonna tell you now what it's gonna be, low or high, I want you to decide where you're gonna hit the ball. Here we go. Excellent, fantastic. Very good. Good. All right, watch the ball, watch it. Stay focused. There, all right, a little wide, come on. There you go. Okay, good. That's it, I like the way you hit that one. You hit it like you meant it. Here we go. Excellent, come on, get back, good. All right, I got you there, come on, good. Come on, almost, you were there, that's it. Come on, keep your head up, head up. That's it, that's the way to nail it. Low one, almost, A low one. There it is, put it away. That's it, all right, little miss hit. Feeding fast here, I'm feeding fast, here we go. That's it, put it away. That's okay, you hit it, you hit it. That one's out too, so what, hit it. All right, see you gotta get over that fear of hitting the ball out, especially on overheads, you gotta just hit it.
Okay, Cindy's gonna put it all together now. We're gonna hit the transition, the approach shot. When you come in, remember the still, the most important thing right now is shot selection. Where you hit that first ball after you get into the uh, ideal volley position. Is it gonna be a short angle or a neutral volley or a put away? Here we go. I like it. I like it because the ball was in the gray area. It wasn't too high and you were going in the right direction. You're one for one, Cindy. One. Nice, nice. Oh, that ball was nice. Come on. Good. That's it. See there you closed with your footwork. Good neutral shot. Come in. That's it. Okay, but loosen up. I want to see you go for that. I want, I want to see you go for a little more on that. Hit it with more authority. Ah, sorry, sorry. Good get! Woo! Awesome. And I like the way you angled it. Here we go. Neutral. Neutral. Neutral again. I'm hitting deep. Nice. There's the short one. I'm going to lob you. Good. Good footwork. Okay, I'm going to hit Cindy some second serves. And this is a ball where many 3-0, 3-5 players, you can do really well attacking this type of ball. Remember, the ball's landing short before the service line. It's just sitting up. That's your time to hit and keep going. Just hit and get in as tight as you can on the net. It's going to make the volley easier. All right, here we go. Okay, you're in, you're in. Okay. Now work on your positioning. Cindy, that means you're spacing. When you see that ball, get set up so you, you've got room to swing. The ball's not in too tight. Excellent, excellent. What are you doing back there? All right, good. You won the point. But I want to see more forward movement after you hit that backhand. Don't stop. All right, that's okay. I like the feeling you had there better. You, your feet were more in gear towards moving forward. Come on, get in. That's it, that's it. Woo! Now you're cooking. You look like you wanted to attack on that. Get in there. Good. All right, I love it. Very nice. Nice backhand. Let's see the attack mode. No stop, come in. Now when you come in, right before I hit, do that little split step. That way you, when you do a split step, what you're trying to do is you're trying to unweight yourself so, so you can move. Because if you're just running forward, then it's hard to go to the side. 